Welcome to the chapter on the history of computer engineering. This chapter covers the key milestones and developments in the history of computer engineering, providing a foundation for understanding the field's current state and future directions. The concept of computing dates back to ancient times with early devices designed to aid in calculations. Let's explore some of these early mechanical computers. The abacus, invented around 2400 BC, is one of the earliest known tools used for arithmetic calculations. It consists of a series of beads that can be moved along rods to represent numbers and perform basic operations. In the 19th century, Charles Babbage designed the analytical engine, a mechanical general purpose computer. Although it was never completed during his lifetime, the analytical engine is considered a precursor to modern computers. It featured an arithmetic logic unit, control flow in the form of conditional branching and loops, and integrated memory. The transition from mechanical to electronic computers marked a significant leap in computing capabilities. Let's look at some of the pioneering electronic computers. Developed by John Atanasoff and Clifford Berry in the late 1930s and early 1940s, the ABC was the first electronic digital computer. It introduced several key concepts, including binary representation of data, electronic switching using vacuum tubes, and the separation of memory and computing functions. The Electronic Numerical Integrator and Computer, or ENIAC, completed in 1945, was the first general purpose electronic digital computer. It was designed to calculate artillery firing tables for the United States Army. Key features of ENIAC included the use of vacuum tubes for computation, programmability via rewiring, and high-speed calculations. The development of transistors and integrated circuits in the mid-20th century revolutionized computer engineering. These innovations paved the way for modern computers. Invented in 1947 by John Bardeen, Walter Brattain, and William Shockley, the transistor replaced vacuum tubes in electronic circuits. Transistors offered several advantages, including a smaller size, lower power consumption, and greater reliability. In the late 1950s, Jack Kilby and Robert Noyce independently developed the integrated circuit, which combined multiple transistors onto a single silicon chip. This innovation led to the miniaturization of electronic devices, increased computational power, and lower manufacturing costs. The invention of the microprocessor in the early 1970s marked the beginning of the modern era of computing. Let's explore some key developments in this revolution. The Intel 4004, released in 1971, was the first commercially available microprocessor. It contained 2,300 transistors and could perform 60,000 operations per second. The microprocessor's significance lies in its ability to integrate the CPU onto a single chip, enabling the development of personal computers. In 1965, Gordon Moore observed that the number of transistors on a microchip doubles approximately every two years, leading to exponential growth in computing power. This observation, known as Moore's Law, has guided the semiconductor industry for decades. The formula can be expressed as the number of transistors is proportional to two raised to the power of the number of years. The 1970s and 1980s saw the emergence of personal computers, making computing accessible to individuals and small businesses. Let's look at some of the pioneering personal computers. Released in 1977, the Apple II was one of the first highly successful mass-produced personal computers. It featured a user-friendly interface, expandable memory, and color graphics. In 1981, IBM introduced the IBM PC, which set the standard for personal computing. Its open architecture allowed third-party developers to create compatible hardware and software, fostering a vibrant ecosystem. The development of the internet and networking technologies has transformed how computers are used and interconnected. Let's explore some key milestones in this transformation. The Advanced Research Projects Agency Network, or ARPANET, launched in 1969, was the first operational packet switching network and the precursor to the internet. It demonstrated the feasibility of distributed networking, 
packet switching, and remote access to computers. Invented by Tim Berners-Lee in 1989, the World Wide Web revolutionized information sharing and communication. Key components of the web include Hypertext Transfer Protocol, or HTTP, Hypertext Markup Language, or HTML, and Uniform Resource Locators, or URLs. Computer engineering continues to evolve, driven by advancements in technology and new applications. Let's explore some of the modern developments and future directions in the field. Artificial intelligence and machine learning are transforming industries by enabling computers to learn from data and make decisions. Key concepts include neural networks, deep learning, and natural language processing. Quantum computing leverages the principles of quantum mechanics to perform computations that are infeasible for classical computers. Quantum bits, or qubits, can represent both zero and one simultaneously, enabling parallel processing. The state of a qubit can be expressed as psi equals alpha times the state zero plus beta times the state one. The Internet of Things, or IoT, connects everyday objects to the internet, allowing them to collect and exchange data. Applications of IoT include smart homes, wearable devices, and industrial automation. The history of computer engineering is marked by continuous innovation and technological breakthroughs. From early mechanical devices to modern quantum computers, the field has evolved to meet the growing demands of society. Understanding this history provides a foundation for appreciating the current state of computer engineering and anticipating future developments.